Oh, there's there's cases, but more time obviously it's the men that lose out, obviously, in it. But I think like there was something going on with Adele or something like that. And the guy who she was married to, she had to pay him some money or something like that, innit? Yeah. But more time, it's the guy that's gonna lose out. Um there was one German woman or something like that, I saw it where basically she had to pay the man out because he was a, a, a banker or a stockbroker. He was a high flyer, yeah, but she earned more than him. Yeah, she was like, a, I don't know, or maybe he was a German stockbroker or something and she was like an American actor or something like that, right? And yeah, she had to break him off some money um, and she was vexed, but well, this is what you get, women. You want equality and that, right? Don't get it twisted. I'm not here trying to bash no women or nothing like that in here, but yeah. You you want equality in that? Well, that's the equality, isn't it? Yeah. It's just, unfortunately, that usually men were the breadwinners, isn't it? So we usually have to foot the bill on that. But I'm not getting married because I heard some horror stories. I used to always talk to, to older men and stuff, and this is why I say, like, this is what I was saying about the earlier in the live stream at the beginning when I was talking about learn from older people and stuff like that, right? Now, when you speak to old people, literally, when they tell you, like, if you're having a general conversation about bullshit, fucking horse racing, or who won football last night, or, yeah, foolishness of holidays and that, yeah, then whatever, in it, yeah. But when older people are telling you stories, yeah, especially bad stories, like horror stories, about, oh, um, a man experienced his, his brother getting cleaned out by two women, yeah, your ears better be open, yeah? Your ears prick up like a fucking Doberman, yeah? Your ears better be pricked up, yeah? That's when you need to be listening. I've been at work, because when I used to work for Holmes Harringay, as I said before, I used to work around a lot of older man, yeah, at Holmes Harringay, when I was an electrician working on my own. I used to go to jobs, I was an electrician, I'll be doing, I'll be rewiring the, the property on my own, but on the job, there might be a carpenter, he might be doing floorboards, changing the doors, changing the worktops. There might be a plasterer, yeah, or there might be a tiler, yeah, or a plumber. And all the men then, they're all older than me, isn't it? These men are all older than me, 20 years. They're old enough to be my dad, yeah, they're my mom's age and that, yeah. And as I said before in the beginning of the live stream, yeah, if I never got off that path, I'd be where they are, yeah, because I'm, I'm walking down the same path as them. So, what's the chances of me not? working for Holmes Harringay when I'm 40, when I'm 45, 50 years old. But anyway, there was a certain man, a certain man, older man, and there was one guy, I used to call him Uncle Mick, black man. Anyway, he told me about his older brother getting cleaned out twice by two different women, literally. Yeah, he said they may as well have sold a fucking carpet. Yeah, that's how he was talking. Yeah, clean him out twice. And he said, I don't know, he said, I don't know what's wrong with my brother. He's stupid. Yeah. You got cleaned out once. Okay, everyone makes a mistake. Sometimes you need to experience certain stuff, yeah. To know say, okay, yeah, that, that's yeah. Like there's certain people, I could be telling people this right now, yeah. Certain people in years to come, they will they'll be watching this, yeah, and then they'll get married and they'll get cleaned out and be like, fuck. Like, I've seen it all on the TV. A man who I watch on YouTube has said it, yeah. And it still happened to me, yeah? But sometimes you need to actually go through that experience to realise, and that's when it will resonate, innit? Yeah? Not me. I am not getting cleaned out, yeah, for me to understand, oh, yeah, well, maybe I shouldn't have got married, yeah? But a man's told me stories like that, horror stories, a man getting cleaned out. Man, are talking about horror stories about a man... <sighs> a man is paying off a mortgage for a property. He's got a wife, he's got children whatever in it yeah they get divorced or whatever for whatever reason yeah the woman moves another man into the house he's got his feet up yeah living for free not working you know the man's not working he's got his feet up he's living for free not doing nothing and the the ex-husband the one who used to live in the house with the family He's staying in a room, yeah, like shared accommodation, yeah, or he's at his fucking mum's house, yeah, whilst he's paying the mortgage for another property that he's not living in, and there's another man in his house, feet up on a coffee table, 
watching Arsenal matches, banging his wife, living for free. When I hear stories like that, yeah, like at work, 19, 20 years old, I'm like, yeah. Like a certain amount, just listen to it and laugh. No, I'm taking that shit in. I'm like, no, that's, that's, no, that's not happening to me. Mm -mm. That's not happening to me. Yeah. Now, I ain't no saint. And I don't know it all. And I've made mistakes. Like, older man have told me, if you stay on the streets, you end up going to prison. Yeah. And I did listen to them and it happened to me anyway. So, yeah. I don't want to just talk this and, no, oh, yeah, well, I've, I've heard stories and experience and I've seen stuff, so I will avoid it myself. No, I've been told and I didn't want to listen, yeah? Like they say in the Jamaican culture, who not here must feel, yeah? That, yeah, that's the sort of thing that my grandma would say, yeah? Who not here must feel, yeah? Which means if you don't want to listen to advice, yeah, you're going to get back, yeah? You don't want to listen to advice, stay off the streets, don't get involved in any criminal activity. You don't want to listen to that? Okay, well, you're going to be in jail, boy. Or dead. Yeah? But situations like that, when a man's paying for his mortgage and there's an, an ex-man in the yard, no, no, no. That's not happening to me, fam. That is not happening to me. There's no way, fam. 